so we are day three and we have just been thoroughly enjoying it. I truly feel that it takes a few days to let yourself really wind down and enjoy where you're at and what you're doing. But it is just gorgeous out here. And there's no better feeling than being able to kick your doors open and just feel that breeze. It just feels so amazing. Everybody, thank you so much for following me along on this adventure. Yeah, I don't know if any of you are coffee drinkers, but I am. And uh, well, I sure love that French press. And it's been very handy pulling this Camp Chef stove right out here on the picnic table. It's made nice doing dinners, coffee. God, I love being out here. The lesson that was learned early on, put your coffee grounds in a container when you travel. The smell of coffee is great, but finding all the little pieces can be a pain in the butt. You know, part of coming out here was to work on some of my projects, but I gotta be honest, it's just so quiet and beautiful out here that it's it's hard to just want to stay busy. You just want to take it in and relax. This is our third day out here, and just finally starting to feel some of that relaxation, kind of letting some of that anxiety down from being in the city. So what I've done in here to make my life a whole lot easier, as you can see, this is vinyl wood flooring in here. Makes it real nice looks real nice and it's easy to clean but another thing that I've done to make things easy to clean is I've taken carpet squares and I put them all over the floor so you can just shake them out especially in those days like in a little bit where we might get a thunderstorm yeah and with the squares on it looks pretty nice well I love this setup Hey boy, how are ya? Good morning. You ready for a thunderstorm? Are you? It's starting to sprinkle. This is the sound of the rain. Thunderstorm finally came in. Someone is not a fan of thunderstorms. Not a fan of thunderstorms. Okay, it's done raining. Don't know if it's gonna do it again. They set off non thunderstorms for the day. But you gotta love the smell after a rain. <laughs> Being in pine trees and out in nature. As we've been going along, we've just been grabbing wood from out of the trees <clears throat> to do our fires. Right now, you can't buy wood from this place. They're encouraging social distancing, so they don't want to take any money. And so, but there is plenty around here. Yeah, it's been a beautiful time out here. It's going to be really hard to leave. It's going to be really hard to go back into trying to do a, a quarantined regular life. We have really very much enjoyed being out here. We would like to just keep going, go to other places and just live the nomadic lifestyle. How gorgeous is this though? If you haven't done it in a while, go for a nature hike. Get all the smells of the pine trees, smells of the vegetation, and it just rained. And so everything just smells wonderful. Blend that little man. His nose is just all over the place. As far as firewood goes, I think that will do us just fine. I'm going to use my axe and hack up this tree. Plus there's tons of little branches and twigs. Should be a beautiful fire. It's a nice calm night. Oh, right. I think we're all about hungry. So tonight, on tonight's menu, we're having spaghetti done on a fire. 
I love campfire cooking. There's nothing like being able to be self-reliant, grabbing what's around you to make your own fuel source. Fires never get old. About every single night we've done a fire. Rained a little bit today, so I'll feel comfortable having a bigger fire. It's so peaceful out here. No wind, nice and calm, crackling of the fire. Now we get lost for a little bit. Back to nature. These fires are a real great way to end the night. Anyway, thanks for following us along on our journey. Uh, we've had a real nice time just kind of getting out of Dodge and uh, taking a moment to relax and kind of get to know ourselves again a little bit. Got to try out a few new products. Tried out that solar shower. That worked pretty good. Um, I've seen some other ways to do those to make showers, and they look pretty neat. Taking the pumpy deal, uh, like for spraying weeds and putting on a hose, and so that might be something we try in the future as well. Yeah, it was just overall real nice to get out. You can really start feeling yourself coming back to you when you get away from the chaos and, and just kind of get out of the beehive, so to speak. Well, if you enjoyed this video at all, please give me a thumbs up. I would greatly appreciate it. If you're watching it and you want to see more, subscribe, hit that notification bell. So until I see you again, be creative. Keep creative, keep your mind alive. Don't be afraid to take on projects that are challenging. And if you're going to trap yourself in four walls, maybe make it a van. Who knows? Have a great night, guys. See you next time.